Y'all was good. Today I'm giving y'all a follow up video to me eating my first meat product yesterday. Um, I told y'all I was gonna let y'all know my results, my overview, uh, my examination of eating a meat product, then going to do my run, you know, and just seeing the trial and error of it, seeing if I gain weight, stay the same, or I lose weight. So let me give y'all a backstory real quick. Yesterday. I tried a chicken chipotle ball, right? Basically grilled chicken in my little vegan ball, right? Today I woke up, um, as usual, did my five miles, did my core workout, did my exercises, took my shower and, and weighed in. When I weighed in, I weighed in at 153. So I lost a pound like usual. I guess... I'm not going to lie, that bowl didn't have as much chicken. If you see the previous video, you'll see that it really wasn't that much chicken in it. So I think that portion might be good for me, or I could add a little bit more, and I think I'll be able to either stay the same or I'll still keep losing pounds, whether it's that day or the following days after that. Like two days later, i lose the pound. I'll basically lose pounds or lose weight. So that's what I got over this um, trial and error and experiment of accidentally having to try my chicken and not try it today, which is my birthday. And I'm finna go to Golden Corral in a little bit. But yeah, I'm at 153 now. I had my first meat product yesterday. And I did my run today, saw the results, and the results was I lost one pound. One thing I can say about the chicken, it did something to my body periodically throughout the day. You hear what I'm saying? So when I first tried the chicken, it immediately made me full. Like I, I felt like I could only eat so much of it and I was gonna be full, right? But then, I don't know, two hours later around, I say about 9, 10 p.m., like my taste buds went up. Um, I was kind of hungry again, but like not too hungry, but it was just like, I could eat something if I wanted to. And then I was just like having a craving for something. I don't know what it was, or if I was, I was having a craving of eating a little bit more than what I ate. So it gave me this weird like, craving for more of it but when i when i ate it the, initially it was like i was immediately full it was like the opposite it was so weird so when i first ate it it's like i'm full i feel like all right yeah it's very strong it's not like i could just devour it i'm chewing it, it like I could, I could feel the taste of it like it's very just solid in your body you, you know it's in there you know you're eating something is what i'm trying to say and then you feel full quick but then it's like hours later even 30 minutes, even like in the morning time when 2 a.m. when I had to go use the restroom, it was like my body was like, hey, Matt, you're kind of hungry now. To where I don't get hungry when I eat the plant-based stuff. For some reason with that, I don't know what they got in that chicken, grilled chicken, but I immediately felt a little bit more hungry for some reason. I don't know. And I just kept, had to adapt to that throughout my sleep and when I was waking up and just kind of forget about it. But I did still feel full, though. I felt full but i felt hungry at the same time it was just this weird feeling eating the meat product though it didn't do nothing to my stomach it didn't make me sick it didn't make me want to throw up it didn't make me feel nauseated or drowned or depressed or sad or upset or something like nah I, I, like i said it felt like it was another item that i add to my regular vegan chipotle bone so i couldn't really tell a difference other than the feeling it gives you um as far as your appetite, how it makes you full quick, but then later on it makes you really hungry out of nowhere. Like it's just weird feeling. But as far as like health wise and pain and what my body did, I didn't see any difference. I didn't see like a gain of weight anywhere. Um, like I said, I lost a pound. If anything, I looked the same as in the day before. My run was easy. Uh, I got through the run with ease. I didn't even realize that I finished my run so fast. I guess because I had the right amount of fuel in me this time because there's chicken protein in it. So that protein gave me a little boost. Had no struggles with it. Uh, felt the same though. It wasn't like it was easier or it was harder. It was the exact same. So, I mean, I have no complaints on it. Uh, I definitely will be trying this again in the future. At least I know now off of experimentation and off evaluation, examination and reviewing it. You know, trial and error. Now I get to see, I kind of know about what amount of chicken I want to use now. So that's pretty cool. But as far as this video, that's pretty much it. I'm going to make another video um, on having the biggest cheat day ever because it's my birthday. So I'm going to celebrate. But uh, 
We'll talk about that next video. Um, like, share, and subscribe. Yeah, ask me any questions, and I'll catch y'all next video.